Welcome back, Royals. Today's video is sponsored by my friends over at Dossier. Guys, Dossier is an online fragrance shop that carries designer and niche inspired fragrances from the top notch designers around the world. We're talking Chanel, Tom Ford, Versace, and the list goes on and on. If there is a fragrance that you have in mind, I'm sure you can find it at Dossier. I decided this month to re-up on some of my tried and true fragrances for the spring season. First up guys was Ambry Cherry. It is inspired by Tom Ford's Lost Cherry and when I tell you it is spot on to the match and the performance of this is second to none. With notes of cherry, plum, and vanilla guys, it is definitely a must have for the spring season. My second option guys for this month was Floral Marshmallows. With notes of bergamot, orange blossom, amber, and musk, it is definitely your nighttime or daytime sexy fragrance to get you through these beautiful spring days. With Dossier guys, they keep the packaging simple, which means they keep the cost down. So you can tap into that designer and niche fragrance collection without tapping into the designer and niche fragrance prices. With Dossier guys, the more you buy, the more you save. So click the link in my description box and shop to your heart's content. They carry fragrances for men, women, unisex, and they even now carry candles inspired by some of your favorite designer fragrances. So do yourself a favor, guys. Click the link in my description box and check out Dossier. I'm sure you'll find something that you will enjoy for the spring, summer, and beyond seasons to get you styling and profiling in your fragrance collection. And now without any further ado, guys, let's get into today's video. Today is, it is painting day and I am so excited about it. We are on the brink of a tumultuous tornado in my area. I want to send out a huge thank you to all of you that reached out to us concerning um, the recent um, disastrous weather that we've had in Arkansas, I think in Tennessee and um, some surrounding areas. Our area was heavily, heavily affected. Thank God that my family and I are safe. Thank God that our home was not damaged. We did, however, have to take shelter under our crawl space. So thank God for a crawl space. It was very scary. It was very, very um, intense. But I thank God for protection. I thank God for keeping us. Our home survived no damage. Um, family members are okay. I had a few clients who literally lost everything. So keep them in your prayers. Um, it's, just, it's just been a lot, but I thank God that in the midst of it all, it could have been so much worse. But as a result of the storm, we were without lights for several days, which means we had to um, discard of some food. So if you can see in the background, we had to re-up on groceries and things like that just to recoup what we lost during the outage. But even for that, I'm thankful that that's the only thing we lost was some groceries we can replace. That you can replace things, but given the state of some of the homes and some of the businesses and even there were some lives that were lost. I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna complain about having to replace some food. Thank God I have the resources to do so. So with that being said, we are going to keep going to a shopping hall, just kind of re-up and replenish. I may or may not do a refrigerator cleanup because your girl has to get to this painting, y'all. I gotta get this content out. The days with us without lights kind of threw my um, scheduling behind. Nevertheless, we're jumping in full steam ahead. We're starting in the entryway, so we're going to do some painting, some entryway styling, a little bit of shopping haul, grocery haul, and who, else, who knows whatever else. But without any further ado, thank y'all for your love and support. But now let's get into the shopping haul so we can get into the painting of it all. So let's go. All right, guys, let's get into it. I'm chuckling because there was a time in my life when I would never buy great value anything. But as you can see, honey, it's great value to the rescue. We have the infamous jalapeno kettle chips, barbecue chips, the indulgent trail mix, dried cranberries, ice cream, all of the things. We have some deli meats, pastrami for the love, turkey for me, all of the cheeses because, again, I had to toss most of them. And we are cheese fanatics over here. So this is my nighttime indulgent. It's simply salted popcorn. We have avocados, lemons, tomatoes. You saw the bread, cherry tomatoes for my salad because your girl trying to get snatched for the summer. We got chicken breast. Y'all, I absolutely love this ground turkey. So I buy it in bulk, as you can see. And I use it for chilies. I use it for tacos. I use it for 
meatloafs, you name it, I use. We got rice cakes, we've got chili flavored tortillas, ginger ale to the rescue, the corns and beans for said chilies, chicken chilies, what have you. Delightful international light on deck, caramel macchiato and French vanilla. We got orange juice, turkey next baby, cause Easter's around the corner and your girl is about to throw down. We got some ice cream treats for those late night sweet cravings. Over here we have some spinach for salads, some pre-mixed salads because during the week I just want to grab and go toss something together and make me a salad. Even my love has tapped into the salad world, which is a blessing because we're trying to stay healthy and well over here. Jasmine rice, some turkey sausage, chicken broth, we needed more salt, deli meat, and the tea game is lit. So that is it, you guys. Those are the things that I needed to re-up on for the week. This will probably carry us a week, maybe a week and a half. And we'll have to do it all over again. Oh, almost forgot. Drinks on deck. Had to stack up my loves. Um, dry bar with Sprite, Coke, and my fave, ginger ale. And so again, that is what we have, you guys. I think I shared everything here. I have fallen in love with the um, Yogi Teas, you guys. They are amazing. I just dropped a little honey and my collagen powder, and your girl is good to go morning after morning. This is my all-time morning fave, me, the word, and the chi. All right, guys, that's it in a nutshell from beginning to end. Now let's let this painting festivity begin. So first things first, let's remove everything out of the space so that we can begin the painting. I knew moving into our home that one thing that was a must for me was changing this paint color. Although it is considered a neutral to me, it's just very lifeless. And I wanted something a little bit brighter, something to um, lighten the space and make it appear even larger, just more open. And I wanted a modern neutral color that would give me the freedom and liberty to style with any color or any tone whether i'm going in the gold family the silver family or the champagne family i wanted just a nice neutral color that would give me that freedom and flexibility where styling was concerned so i'm removing everything out so that we can begin with the painting of it all in addition to the painting guys there will be other updates to come but if you've ever moved into a home you know that Rome was not built in a day, and neither will the updates of my home be built in a day. We are turning this space into our royal chateau, one space at a time. So I figured the easiest way was to come into the entryway and just work my way throughout the house and not get overwhelmed with all of the projects at hand. So my love is jumping in to help me stir the paint because it's been sitting for some days. Again, we were kind of delayed with the... Um, ladies storms and just things and work schedules we just was delayed so we are days behind our anticipated painting schedule nevertheless we're getting it done now so i'm looking through this little kettle guys i picked this bucket up from walmart and it is a painting kit and it has 32 pieces in it and to my surprise it had everything but what i was comfortable using for painting and that was just the typical paint tray so i'm going through the list of things making sure that it had it and i didn't overlook it or what have you but it doesn't have it so off to walmart but before i do i just could not resist to see what this color looked like guys i told you guys i went with this a nice creamy neutral and this color is called greek villa by sherwin williams and i am absolutely loving it it's just light and bright and airy and it's going to give me all the thrills and feels and you'll see just how excited your girl gets along the way but i just could not resist just getting this cute little handy dandy tool which is an edger and just touching up that little space just to get a feel for what it's going to look like i was so anxious and i needed to take a break to go pick up the paint tray but i just couldn't resist y'all and i'm loving it so let's get to walmart y'all so i can get this paint tray and get back home and finish these tasks that i have on my to-do list but isn't it yummy? I just, and I know someone may be saying, Trina, it's just white, but it's just, it's just right. It's just right for me. When you are a stylist that interchanges and likes to switch up your decor, a nice neutral backdrop is what you need. So off to Walmart I go, but not before adding other little to-do things to my list of things. So while I'm out, I'm going to run a few more errands and try to get back as quickly as possible. Huh, two hours later, we're back, but mind your business. 
So now, in the words of the infamous MC Hammer, let's get it started, y'all. I'm so excited. So let's get to it. She's wondering if it's gonna feel like she's forever Wondering if it's gonna feel like she's whenever She leaves her safe space She leaves her safe space Wondering if it is forever Or is there some place that will make her feel better Make her feel better Then that's where she'll go Free. 
Now, guys, I am absolutely loving this color, but what I'm loving even more is this handy dandy little edger. Guys, it is a lifesaver. Now, what I realized was that I probably should have went in and did my cutting prior to starting on the wall, but I was so anxious, but you live and you learn, and it's only paint, so I am going to change my strategy on the next wall, but I absolutely love how clean it allows me to get against the corners and as I'm painting, I'm realizing that the doors that we thought were white are not so white up against this um, Greek Villa color. However, we will be touching up the doors later on um, in the year or maybe even right after this. Who knows? But as I'm painting, it's just all kind of thoughts are going through my head is what I want to do to enhance this space. Of course, lighting. We already have the lighting. On hand it's just a matter of changing it out we'll be changing out the hardware on the doors and I'm toying with the idea of painting the inside of the entryway door black the outside I'm gonna automatically paint black because I think it'll be perfect for the outside accents but I'm kind of playing around with that idea in my head on the black door you guys let me know what you think and I want to keep the chrome theme going so I'm going to just do some nice chrome or polished um, nickel hardware on the doors and I'm even considering some um, crown molding or the wainscoting in this area there's a lot of little cutouts and niches in the walls but I think that will add a little bit of extra character and dimension to the wall but right now I am just loving the light and brightness of this Greek Villa color. So I'm going to enjoy that and then just kind of play around with the other things I have in mind as we go. But definitely the next time you see this space, the lighting will be changed and there may or may be touched up on the doors. Can't promise that. But the um, strategy that my love and I are taking as far as our home remodels is we are working from the top down. So light fixtures, wall color, door um, hinges and door knobs, and then the flooring will probably be the last well, that probably it will be the last thing that we tackle. So that is way down the road. We just kind of want to make those quick cosmetic changes. And again, not get so overwhelmed with all of the things on our to-do list because the list keeps growing, guys. The list keeps growing. However, I don't want to tell him I love that, but what he is agreeing to right now is paint and light fixtures. So we're going to roll with that. And we know that phone is on down the line, but I am loving 
what this is doing to the space so far. It's just giving it a lighter, brighter, more modern feel. And I cannot wait to style this space with you guys. So extra, but I know I'm the same. Yeah. Love me in spite of my trauma. Give me what I need instead of the drama. Cause when it pop off, it's like oh my, all good all day, but the night we be going so hard on the flip side. So tell me we'll be on a day, babe. I could keep that same energy. When you go low, I go low too. But you'd rather stay high, I know. Can we stay high, babe? I'd rather be on that way. Trying to control our emotions. If we on a rise out of passion, we could share love in the ocean. But if you want to go insane, either way, baby, we could go all night. We could do it all night. We could go all night, all night. Do we heal? Do we bleed? I'm going to follow like you. Calls go to voicemail. I block you so I don't raise hell. Should the talk through it in detail? I separate ways, ain't gon' end well. No, but when we get back, it's like oh my, all bad all day. But the night I get that good, good till we act right. So tell me where we on the day, babe. I could keep that same energy. When you go low, I go low too. But you'd rather stay high, I know. Can we stay high, babe? I'd rather be on that wave. Trying to control our emotions. If we on a rise out of passion, we could share love in the ocean. But if you want to go insane either way, baby, we could go on. We could do it all night. We could go all night, all night. Do we heal? Do we bleed? I'm going to follow yo. I'm cool collected, but you pushing on my nerves and knowing your attention, I'm under pressure. Okay, I'm admitting that a couple things I said got acidic in the tone and the presence, I get careless. Long as you know, I come with imperfections. When you look at me, you see the soul through my flesh. You something special. Know you looking bomb the way you dress it. Gone flex it, hold it still and let my mind digest. You got the leverage. You got the upper handle on the situation. You worthy of a million more of the storms that we weather. We fight retreating, then fuck, but you trying to kill the cycle. When nobody's stressing that body like me, I know the way you like it. I treat you like a queen, run the castle, you a treasure. Feel like you setting fire to my desire for the pleasure. You a gem, got me blim, let's make amends. No, you can't, I'm out here. Trying to control our emotions. If we on a rise out of passion, we can share love in the ocean. But if you wanna go insane, either way, baby, we could go on. We could go all night. We could go all night. Do we heal, do we bleed? I'ma fall like yo. Well, guys, if you're still rocking with me, I want to thank you. And as you can see, the painting festivities are off to an amazing, amazing start. I am absolutely loving the transformation that is taking place with this paint color. It's amazing the difference that paint can make in a space. It's definitely opening it up, giving it a more brighter, airy feel. And I am so excited about it. Now, if this is your first time visiting, you see what you like and you like what you see, I want to invite you to hit that subscribe button and join the royal family. As you can see, we are full of inspiration, motivation, and so much creativity. Now, to my tried and trues and my brand new booze, you guys already know that I so love and appreciate you. Thank you all for your continued support. Guys, I want to invite you to click that notification bell. Hit it twice so that you always know when I upload new content. As you can see, there are plenty of switching, changing, and rearranging taking place in Chateau Royale. You guys, I am so excited about the next video because in that video, we will be, again, adding new 
light fixture in this space. We will be styling it up and bringing you some more amazing surprises. And so you don't want to miss it. The Secret Garden Spring theme is well underway. And I want you to come along and be a part of the entire spring styling journey with me. If you haven't already connected with me on my other social media platforms, I can be found at Royalty Designs with Trevina on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Also, guys, click the link for my Amazon storefront. You will find some amazing home decor items to get your home style to your liking for this season and many seasons to come. Guys, drop a comment. Let me know what you think of this new paint color. In your opinion, is it a yay or is it a nay? I just want to know because it ain't changing. But I want to know how you feel and what you think. And if you see the amazing difference as I see it. I don't know if the camera is resonating. Just how bright and open this space is already looking. But I am so loving it. Now, guys, until the next video, as always, I want you all to stay safe, remain royal, and have yourselves a blessed and most beautiful, beautiful day. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.